confident that I had the first down. I, just, I guess they just gave us a bad spot. And when they went to review it, I definitely thought that they was going to give it to us. But I guess it wasn't uh, enough. How frustrating is it to come up short um, in one of those situations again? It's real frustrating, uh, especially five in a row. Uh, most players on the team probably never been in this position before. Uh, we just got to work and finish the season strong. On the, the fumble, Montel, um, you looked like you were in the open for a little bit there. Did you did you think you were more in the open than you were, or, or what happened on the on the fumble? Yeah, uh, it opened up, and uh, I seen green grass in front of me. I thought I was going to uh, break out. Uh, the ball got kind of loose, and somebody tried to tackle me and tackle the ball, and it came loose. You've been around here a long time, Montel, obviously. What kind of leadership <laughs> skills do you see from Chase as a, as a younger quarterback? Well, uh, he's always talking in the hub, trying to get everybody up. Even when we're down, he's telling us, let's go, we got to go. Everybody getting everybody in and out of the huddle. And uh, I feel real confident about Chase. And we should be able to win these last five games. The line got shuffled up a little bit this week. Uh, what do you think the way they played with this uh, setup? I think the line played uh, very well today. Uh, was able to give me some holes at times. Uh, we just got to keep working. And, uh, we'll keep getting better throughout the year. What does it mean to you passing 3,000 yards? You probably knew it was going to come eventually. But uh, to actually get past that milestone, move two rungs up on the all-time rushing list, what, what kind of perspective do you have on that? Um, it's always good uh, <laughs> to I guess do good, but it's not good enough because we're not winning. So I really don't pay attention to that.